Hey, viewers, that's Craft here. Before we get started, a few things. First off, I chose Orn because honestly, I never expected Orn to get a fifth skin canonically, including his base one. I usually only do champs after they get their fifth like skin, including base. And after how long it's been, I didn't expect Orn. So yeah, uh, I've been delaying this one a few times because of certain reasons and things that came up. But yeah, I want to get into it. So without further ado, let's get into it. As always, basic thing is a 5, and yeah, Orn design-wise is pretty cool, being the whole primal god of the forge and fire kind of design, yeah, it really fits this design pretty well. Again, you only really see the forging aspect in his passive, but design-wise, he physically dressed and looks like a smith. Heck, it looks like his left hand could actually just go into the fire itself, honestly. And fire-wise, yeah, no, his entire design, his entire kit screams fire and ram. So yeah, all in all, pretty decent for a base. You know, at first, even though I own this skin, I always thought that, oh, they just recolored the fire blue, but actually taking a good hard look at it, no. They replaced all fire effects with lightning effects. The clouds are not being the dark ash clouds, but being more of storm clouds in all his effects. And honestly, yeah, it's pretty decent and cool. You can actually see the individual details in all the attacks, replacing the fire with a lightning storm strike. And yeah, honestly, I think this skin is really good in Deserves a 7. The colors and visuals of this skin alone already make it such a good look. I love the idea of the whole beard being nothing but leaves as his body is a tree. And yes, I know that's kind of Ivor's thing, but I feel like Orn does it better, honestly. And the concept of whole, like, mythical fey creatures forging with, you know, non-normal forged materials kind of seems cool. The whole crystal fey magic effect to it entirely. And as a D&D nerd, I think this is a really good skin and deserves an 8. Yeah, no, I do really believe Space Groove Orn was kind of a letdown. Again, his beard is not as cool. The best little detail I could find is the lava lamp effect in his horns. But even that, the rest of his model is still kind of eh. His hammers are not even really hammers. The ram, his ult actually looks decent, but besides that, the rest kind of feels eh. And where Space Groove has some of this kind of like goo effect to its abilities, it's there, but with Orn's colors being a sort of bluish orange look to it, a bit of yellowish even, I would say that it's kind of meh in design wise, and I give it a five. This is Goofy done right. All the little details in this are just very much well done. First off, instead of using the usual war horn, he has a train whistle, which calls forth the big train. Second, he actually does have train whistle effects that you will hear when he uses abilities. His horns actually produce smoke during certain abilities. He has, instead of a hammer, a giant wrench and a shovel for coal. He has a little train around his body. And again, the small details are just so nice and adorable. It's great. And for a goofy skin, I think this is the best one for Orn. It just fits. And I give it an 8. And that'll do it. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, leave a like and share if you will. Comment down below the channel you'd like to see. And I'll see you all next time. Peace.